Hello Vikings and welcome back to another Assassin's Creed Valhalla video. So, as asked in the comments, I'm doing a remake of the AFK slash BRB farm. However, first things first, so into the settings, into the skills, into the gear. So, as you can see, I'm pretty much max level. I'm missing the one skill point, like some of you might have missed as well. On each mastery, I will have 170 in this video, so fair warning, if you are low level, this trick might not work for you. But what we need, most of all, from the skill points, or from the skill tree, on the bear brands, the Idun's Heart. Draw upon a widely of Idun, passively regenerate recent health loss after a short delay. Basically, you are getting health back, doing nothing, so this is gonna be really useful doing this farm. Alright, what comes to the gear and runes? I highly recommend using armor, health runes, even resistance to fire damage runes. So, minus weight, stealth damage, those kind of runes, don't use them on this build slash farm. So, what you need, you need full 5 set of the fallen hero armor set. 2 set bonus is giving you plus 10 armor, plus 15 melee damage and plus 15 rage damage. Also, the 5 set bonus from this gear, getting hit drops a pulse that explodes after a delay, dealing damage in an area and knocking enemies down. Cooldown 10 seconds, so every 10 seconds you are getting explosive pulse. Depending on the enemies, they are pretty much dead after one explosion. And no, this won't be a fast way of getting XP, but this is something you can do when you have real life stuff to do for short periods of time. And when I say short, I mean anywhere from like 5 minutes to 1 hour. Of course, take this with grain of salt. Even I have almost died when doing this trick when the enemies are throwing fire bombs at me. So, fire damage, it is really bad thing. Also, what you want to do, go into the settings on the gameplay, on the combat difficulty. Here, go to scold slash easy instead of Default, hard, very hard or nightmare, you are getting much less damage from the hits of the enemies. If you want, you can set everything on easy, not necessary, the combat difficulty is the main thing. When the game asks you to reload the game, and if that doesn't happen, you have to do it manually in order to settings to kick in. For example, that did happen to me in this video. The game didn't reload itself, so we have to go manually. On the title screen, tear, load and recent auto save. Or if you want, you can do quick save and load from that. After the loading is done, make sure that your combat difficulty is on easy as wanted for this one like I am doing right here. After that I'm gonna show the location where I'm starting this one. I'm gonna share two locations. The first is in Gloucester and the second one, well, we are going into that location in a little bit later on in this video. Also note that I'm gonna speed up a little bit the actual farming parts, so the actual AFK parts of this video, not to stretch this video to be over 30 minutes long, so hopefully you will understand that and hopefully you will enjoy the same. Note that you can do this in any location that has heavy population of enemies, so these places that I'm going to show, they are not must, they are just for examples, but pretty much you can do this anywhere where you have enemies. Yet the best places to do this is the places that has patrols coming and going. For example, Gloucester is actually a pretty good place. We have high population of enemies and also patrols are coming through this city every now and then from couple different directions. Let's see in real time how the boom is actually going and look at the enemy. He's blocking the spear from the shield bearer. So boom, 10 seconds and now we are speeding up. One thing I have to say after the update 1.4.1, the enemies have been acting really weird. Sometimes they stop, sometimes they bug. So beware of that. 
hopefully this will be fixed in the future but for now this is slow but working method of getting brb xp without doing nothing So after total time of 35 to 40 minutes of farming in this one location, let's collect the trinkets, let's collect the silver from the dead enemies and let's move on after that one. As I said, this is low, you are not gonna level up like super fast, but this is something you might want to consider doing every now and then. Plus, if possible, try to keep one archer alive in case of the bugged melee enemies that might be just standing there going around you again again and again so when the archer is hitting you with the arrows still there will be the explosion that might kill the melee enemies and our second location in this video is gonna be earning stone in Grandupitshire here we have kinda big camp full of enemies and this location will take like 10 minutes to complete the farm for me there were two to three enemies left that were bugged the bell ringer and couple others were stuck and I wasn't able to kill them this way but as you can see in the video we are ranking up the parties really really fast Alright, enemies are pretty much dead right now and it's time to go back in cluster and this time we are gonna do the farm for approximately 20 minutes to 30 minutes and this one is really close call because of the fire damage that I'm going to receive in this try. Also if you are gonna try this method please let me know in the comments down below. Also hitting the like, hitting the subscribe button would really help me out and it will help you out if you don't want to miss anything that I upload or when I go live. But let's repeat this area once again.
zombie can stop us. So, as I hinted previously, this one was a fail, but usually this works for short periods of time. So, there are definitely ups and downs, and if you know any other locations, let me know. Hopefully, this was helpful to you. If it was, you know what to do, but let's roll the outro. Thanks for watching, remember to hit the like, hit the sub, turn on the notifications so you won't ever miss anything that I upload or when I go live. Also Vikings, have fun, stay safe, be strong, hope to see you in the next one, Skatha, over and up, and bye bye.